Good morning guys. I figured I haven't done a cleaning vlog in months. I think maybe since I have moved to this apartment or even before I moved here. So I thought I would do that. So we're on a Saturday. It's midday and um, I've had a busy week as always. So I thought I would show you what my apartment looks like and then I show you how I actually get it ready for the week ahead. Now um, I'm in a bit of a weird situation because I might be starting a new project next week where I might need to travel for half the week and then I also might have to go abroad for a couple of weeks and something like that so I need to also do some packing and I will just walk you through all of that so I'm just looking at my eyes now it's out of habit I just look whether my eyes are puffy or not because I'm still waiting for them to go down but yeah so I'm just gonna do a very quick state of the union kind of uh, thing so this is my um, bookshelf not bad this is my living room just need to fix the cushions this isn't really messed up yesterday I did some meditation so I have some stuff probably need to organize this I just had breakfast very late breakfast that's my computer I let the dishwasher run overnight and I had just started emptying it before I thought you know what I might as well film what I'm doing this is where I had my, my I made my breakfast some stuff from Kaiser that's just bread and that's the mess the rest I think is fine I recently got this water bottle I just got it a, a day ago and uh, it's an inspirational one because some guy in, in, in my team needed a water bottle I got him one I mean he's just a young kid so I was like I'll get you one and I actually also ended up buying myself one um, entryway is doing okay this there isn't really a ton of things compared to usual these are things I need to toss this is a, a Burberry scarf holder I need to toss my shoes that I've been wearing during the week some of my laundry that is dried out that I have put out I need to fold it then a bit of the mess from the week um so these are my gym clothes because i can finally start working out again so i'm trying to organize this um, this is not bad but i have to organize all of this stuff these are all the little knickknacks that i hadn't organized yet from the time i had moved so i need to clean that do my bed i had started packing and then i have my makeup station that i need to organize but um yeah so let's get started In two minutes it looks much better everything is in place later on I might have to just hoover and swipe the surfaces but I'm happy with this now on to the kitchen ha ha ha
and that's the kitchen done in 15 minutes it's not spotless but um, much better and I could start my next week with that my fridge is also relatively organized I have a whole cheese and cheese accompaniment section but other than that it's pretty clean I must say the part that I dread the most is usually my room because um, I accumulate things that I don't even know where I got them from also this week exceptionally I had been kind of cleaning up so not cleaning up but like trying to get all the little bits out uh, because I want to have everything in one spot so my makeup thing is just exploded because I have all my makeup bits now in one single place I have things that I had from Brussels that I had put in storage oh I'm looking at my two little puffs that I had put in storage and I never touched and now I'm just getting them out and I'm also preparing for a trip as I said earlier so this is not usually how my room looks like so um, I think I'm gonna have a bit more tea watch a youtube video and then tackle my room because yeah i'm gonna need some strength for that and some good music yo i had a little catch up with my sister and then i listened to some music watch a youtube video i'm really struggling recently with youtube like i can't really find something that i really want to watch uh it seems that everything is just so repetitive and I'm just bored with YouTube content these days. I mean, it's been weeks like that. So yeah, um, I finished packing all my trash, so that's ready. This is the plastic recycling. And um, <laughs> these are all the extra contact lens cases that uh, I had. I, I kind of had to go through all this stuff. You can see the volume is slightly, slightly decreasing. I have my my pillow co case always gets that because on Friday nights I usually like to put on a mask and um, sleep with it so I always have that this is slightly more organized although it doesn't look like it I have pre-packed so I have I might have three or two days in Coventry we don't know when I get the call my bag is ready all what I have to do is pick uh, a few tops and uh, two bottoms and that's it and then I also prepared the additional bags that I will add to just this uh, for the following trip because I will have two weeks in the US one week in the East Coast one week in the West Coast and uh, so extreme differences in weather uh, and I, j I don't want to take another bag it's gonna be still this one but I'm gonna add more things uh, that's my bedside I think this bit is gonna take a little more time it might take one or two weeks until I get down to it but that's everything I have left from when I moved I folded all the clothes in here and this is ready for me to go um, and I also did a very quick laundry of all my silks so um, I'm very I'm very happy that I have found the silk sitting uh, in my washing uh, machine because then I got to do all of these before I would have done all of them by hand but uh, I did all of them I definitely took a risk on this ecru one but uh, it's fine uh, it came out relatively okay I think in a couple of washes it would be fine but it's not the first time that I do this and uh, I have been really enjoying that so to, pu to put things a bit in context I am filming a series for the month of May which is about how I do a sort of um, spring review where I just look at my style, look at my body, my wardrobe, my uh, beauty cabinet, everything. And I do a sort of a, a reassessment and deep declutter and everything. But then while filming this video, I decided to have a two or three week break um, that you will not see on video, but uh, just a break for me to live with the new setup as it is and I have noticed that even though I don't fit in most of the clothes the fact of having now uh, a clearer wardrobe and having a, a routine for washing and all of that I feel like I'm starting to reach an equilibrium where I have clothes in the wash clothes on on the racks things that I need to pack for my travels and things that are just trying so I feel like we're slowly getting to a, a state of equilibrium which I really really like now I'm just gonna take these bits and put them in my recycling because uh, I'm gonna get the recycling out in a bit
I'm a bit hungry well very hungry to be honest so I'm gonna make myself a cheese board and in the meantime I have just made a chicken soup it's one of my favorite soups to make um, it's chicken with rice and um, green peppers and that's it it looks a bit yellow but uh, I initially wanted to have some saffron <sighs> I have discovered recently this cheese shop called Paxton and, and, and Whitley and I have been going there essentially every Friday. This is a Stichelton which is a type of blue cheese that is like Stilton but creamier. Um, and then I have quite a few bits of cheese in here and then I bought tons of stuff like pen, banana, I have quince and apple. So I'm gonna make my little cheese board. This is a raisin and walnut bread. This is my finished cheese board for my little pick-me-up. Um, this is Comté Vieux. It's very old Comté. And I usually just cut off the rind because it's been aged for so long. Um, I don't want to eat that. Next to it, I have some Beaufort. I will also not eat the rind on that. Uh, it's also old. And then I have some pear and vanilla to go with these. Then I have some cheddar, which is my favorite. This is aged cheddar. It's my favorite type of cheese. And then I have this quince and apple kind of puree. It's just a confit, and it goes well with blue cheeses, and this is Stichelton. Very creamy. If you like Stilton, try this. This is a fresher version of it. I, I, I prefer it to Stilton, to be completely honest. But yeah, so this is my board. I'm going to have my bread, make some tea, and I'm all good to go. Ta -da! green tea my fish cell from Maison Kaiser and then all the cheeses happy 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 Uga right so um, it's late it's almost 11 p.m. Um, I was with my sister She'd had a very long day at work. This is why you don't get bangs when you're a curly girl, because they just go up like this. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I had a dinner with my sister. I cooked her a roast. Every time my sister comes, I, look, I, I cook her lamb roast. She's had a very, very long day, so I made sure that she had food at the moment she got in. And I just cleaned up a bit. Um, she's very busy, so she's going to also come tomorrow which means that tomorrow I'm gonna cook her again and tomorrow I think I'm gonna make her a pheasant I have a pheasant I also made quite a few batches of this chicken soup so I'm gonna get the pheasant out and let it thaw in the fridge overnight mm. might get some veggies for tomorrow because today we only had rice um, and I think we need some veggies in our diet so I'm going to let the pheasant in the fridge now. So that was very quickly how I would spend a chill Saturday, you know, just doing things around the house. My uh, clothes are dry right now, the, the silk ones. So I'm going to just take them out and tomorrow I will steam some of them. Um, I will probably go for a walk or something like this. But um, uh, yeah, that's how I spend my weekend. I actually genuinely enjoy spending weekends at my place. A lot of people think that you need to always go out and stuff, but I get more energy being home, having my little rituals. I'm going to do my, uh, my meditation in a bit, uh, rather than just going out all the time. So I, as an extreme introvert, I don't really get that much energy from that. So yeah, 
that is it for today i hope you enjoyed this little cleaning with me vlog and i will see you very soon on my channel take care